nice. Alright, where does that put us on neural mods? Eight. Alright, so what was what was the plan? Lab tech will let me do upgrades to my other weapons. Probably should have grabbed this a lot earlier. <laughs> the recycling expert, if I'm going to be doing all this recycling. Ugh, do, do I grab that and the upgrade thing, or do I start going to town on telepathy? What did I say was really useful sounding? Where's the thing that stuns? Electrostatic burst. Targets an air. Oh, maybe it's. Is it slow moving? Hmm. Early on, it's a pretty short stun. I would need level two for it to be useful, I think. It's a trap of superheated plasma. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I do really like the phantom shift idea. I don't actually know if it'll be useful, but I think I'm going to go for it. I think I'm going to grab phantom shift and maybe also start to work on... Uh, Uh, electrostatic. Right. Is there any reason not to? Oh, this is locked. Oh, no, it's not. I can. As long as. I... Just kidding. It is locked. Alright. Is there anything else that I want even more? I didn't notice this. You can. There's a better. Co okay, so my combat fo focus I've been using is weak. This one, time slows less for you than it does for your enemies, and your attacks deal more damage, and actions cost less stamina. And this one, all the way up, time slows around you, but you can move normally, and it's for 15 seconds. Oh my god. to me I think I do want that one more than anything now that I know that it gets better also don't I probably want more health so I don't freaking die all the time all right I'm taking this you couldn't stop me oh is it like you I regained some of my my you are actually one of the aliens memories. The first time you said it was like you were outside yourself, like time itself had bent its knee, waiting for you to decide. You moved my chair without touching it. It gave me chills. The possibilities. You became something new that day. Something higher. I knew then, as I believe now. Our mission is to lift up all humanity in the same way. Would you replay this with knowledge of what mod options are available? Um, I don't know if it would re... Like, I'm still going to wind up, I guess, taking... I I still have the same plans as always, which is don't have a plan. Constantly change my mind. <laughs> Some powers, yes, I've been doing that. To stop time and enter it. Hold mouse to. I see. All right, so now it's going to work more like, I don't know, Mass, Eff Mass Effect maybe. And this headaches. 
They're getting worse. My teeth in the brain are sinking in. You feel it, am you? Screaming is louder now. Getting close. I think screams are coming from the future. And you. Screams of people on Earth. Screams an animal. Makes one caught in a hunter's jaw. Alright, in my room, did I think to install a recycler? I guess not. Memory logs? Calvino, colleague, won't notice anything wrong. Eidetic memory. Work obsessed. Perfect medical record, no absences. Calvino, colleague, won't notice anything wrong. Eidetic memory, work obsessed. Perfect medical record, no absences. New entry, show, Danielle. Head of IT, dislikes you. Dislikes Alex more. Need to find out why. Note to self, research. Chef Mitchell and emotive operator hack. <laughs> Is one of these going to say, uh, John G. killed my wife? One of Alex's hires. Cheap to recruit due to his unpopular stance on psychic phenomena. One of the station's best scientists. Introvert. Knows about tests. Loyal to Alex. Believes your brother and Typhon can save his career. Michaela Ilyushin. Chief engineer. Not on speaking terms. Had brief relationship. You ended it when tests began. She believes it is because you discovered her medical condition, paraplexus. Convenient, but false. Severing ties seem prudent to you. Less painful, given the impending memory loss. Paraplexus, nerve disorder. Prevents use of neuromods. Requires aggressive drug therapy to prevent degeneration. Renders candidates ineligible for assignment to Talos 1. Right. Sarah Elazar, chief of security. Not a friend. Knows about the Python. Not about your tests, but suspects. It is trustworthy, but doesn't trust Alex. Or you, yet. Interesting. Now, on my status, does it say... Typhon material in your system is just below the threshold where station turrets will consider you a threat. Got it. So if I if I do any more, um, how much how much have I done? Just one. Just one already did that. If it was easier to find <laughs> ammo for the Q-beam, maybe I would consider upgrading that, but no. And I already forgot, did I... I opted not to. See, now it's a little... Oh, man. <laughs> It's like I wouldn't have I wouldn't have bothered to buy these two. I I guess there is a little bit of like regret that uh, I might not have bothered to get either of these if I had realized that I was not going to go through the whole game wrenching things. <laughs> so what was the lab? Okay, and I did not take lab tech. So let me go ahead and spend this on the shotgun. All right, 
there anything else? Oh, there's another weapon upgrade kit. Probably do want those, right? I can drop something else. Or no, I'm gonna use this again. Um, maximum fire power. Wait a second. This looks like this looks like well, it looks a little bit like the the room where I woke up in the beginning of the game, but it's not. Could an emulated entity be granted power of attorney? Over the last few decades, the public has become increasingly familiar with artificial helpers, from the personal assistants on their wristwatches to the smart home systems that remind you where you put your keys. But more recent advances in hy hybridic tech and the genius of connectomics the ability to map the myriad neur neuronal connections inside a person's brain have thrust digital doppelgangers squarely into the legal arena recently billionaire rourke wallace granted power of attorney not to one of his many estranged family members why why would he <laughs> but to a robotic facsimile of himself named ransom ransom emulates mr wallace's own reasoning interests and to some extent personality quirks to the point where the two are nearly indistinguishable at least over the phone in person ransom's molded ceramic and carbon body while beautiful make his true nature unmistakable needless to say mr wallace's family is not amused especially concerning ransom's decision for how to execute mr wallace's will yeah this was pretty similar which is this a closet then is it a closet now no it is not Yeah, this this is laid out the same as oh, they gave me so much random food that does not stack. Don't want it. Fermi's the Fermi. Uh, what do you call it? Consider that there are billions of stars in the galaxy, like our sun, many of them far older. Some of these stars will have Earth-like planets. Some of these planets may have developed intelligent life. Some intelligent life may develop interstellar travel. If a civilization began before ours, it seems possible, even probable, that even at the speed of currently envisioned interstellar travel, they could already have the entire galaxy colonized. The problem is we haven't detected any such civilizations, nor have any contacted us. Why? Yeah, the, the Fermi Paradox, which I don't think is properly called a paradox. I think that there's a... whoops... Sorry, couch. <laughs> That's better. I think a reasonable answer to that is that intelligent life, or even life, just plain old regular life developing from, from nothing, from star stuff, as we did, is so incredibly unlikely that we actually, you know, who knows, maybe we are the first in the universe. Because you would say, oh, well, that's, like, what's the average time that it takes for for life to conveniently develop? It's like, well, well, we did it, so it can't take all that long on average. It's like, well, that's what the first, the first living thinking species would say anyway. <laughs> they would say, oh, well, if we couldn't be the first. That would be way too unlikely. We exist, therefore, someone else, like, we must be nearly average. <laughs> Surely we must be nearly average. 
We could be exceptional, but we couldn't be that exceptional. But someone is. <laughs> one, one, somebody has to be first. And it could be us. Oh, I'm already full health. Was there a time? Yeah, I can always search that. Should I? Well, I'll keep going a little longer. Just a little longer. Uh, there is a recycler nearby, I'm pretty sure. Oh, it's up. I know it's upstairs. It's right here. And what is that? A wedding ring? To Nicole, always and forever. Kevin, when did I pick that up? I don't think I've been carrying it that long. Could still do that. Might be wait. Oh, she might be waiting outside the fitness center window. So I should go in. Okay. I misunderstood that. I thought it was. I was supposed to go outside. Spacewalk around to the fitness center and knock on it, and she would let me in, or something. Tons of stuff. Oh, right. I would like to take the stuff, but cannot because reasons. Hello. And then does she die? Morgan? If you're here, then... Abby didn't make it, did she? I don't... How am I hearing you? This must be very thick glass. Nothing more that I can do for you right now. But look, be careful. There's someone else in crew quarters pretending to be the cook. I know it. His tracking bracelet's from Psychotronics, but the ID doesn't make any sense. He... I think he's the one that killed Abby. If you can, make sure he doesn't get off the station. I'll see what else I can do to help from out here. For as long as I can. Goodbye, Morgan. Okay, well, can't I let you in? And no, she said that she, she would, um... The note actually said that she would feel the vibrations on the glass if uh, if you knocked, or if the if the other girl if the, if the girl knocked. Kill the imposter cook. Could I have gotten? No, I guess I I couldn't have gotten this. Uh, Objective updated. Why? Did I, did I hear him? No. Well done finding Chief Show. You've got what you need to get into deep storage. I already did. What are you looking at? So yeah, we, we figured out earlier on that this guy is not actually the cook.
Or we were at least confused by the fact that he didn't seem to be the cook. So if I... If I can't get into those... What is the trick? Do feel like I, I want to lurk in here even longer until I've resolved more things. But there are also other things that I could go, you know, go back to earlier, uh, earlier sections and resolve those quests that I skipped over. Or I could continue onward. that he didn't teleport up with me how rude can I loot him from here loot loot needs to be a lot more considerate of people who are trying to uh oh could i oh could i could i lock it so it stops working a single apple well i'm dragging you out of there Um, all right, Elias Black. If I here's the thing. Did I look at these? E yes, I did. Elias Black, Elias Black. Security in the Talos One lobby. Well, I guess that doesn't necessarily mean he has his map on him, but it, it could mean that. Cargo bay? That's nowhere near me. division. Never figured out that safe combination.
<laughs> yeah, the whole uh, simulation. We're a simulation in a... Or, no, what's the... There's some kind of, like, weird paradox thing that I'm like, it's not really a paradox. Where they're like, the longer... The longer life goes on, the more likely people will figure out a way to simulate a universe. And because each simulated universe can have so many more people in it than our universe, that that means that there's basically a almost 100% chance for any given person that they are, in fact, living inside a simulation. Like, I don't think that's how it works. <laughs> Meh. Oh no, wait. I want to scan it. Right? Yeah, I need to scan one more of these. Nope, just kidding. No new data. Oh, I'm full of stuff again. And why are Mimics back? That makes me angry. Is the Nightmare also back? No. Julian Howard up there? Bruh. Damn it. Hate you, electricity. Despite all the good you do for us. No. Where is that the right way to the guy? Where's the guy? The guy is over. Oh, can I not get to him? Is he in Alex's office? Well, I don't, I don't think that that theory is necessarily saying that there's, like, nested simulations, but just, I don't know, it just, whatever the deal is. That, oh, no. Don't forget that trans oh, star safety standards mimic. call for a weekly inspection of your uniform. Report to the hardware labs for a diagnostic. <gasps> Can I glue climb up this? This might be unintended, in which case it will be very difficult. Actually, it is. Oh, like side to side, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. 
makes a little more sense. <laughs> There's Julian Howard. Yesterday's batch was an abysmal failure. Piss poor root initiation. However, Dr. Lin from Psychotronics was kind enough to provide me with a sample of material that should multiply the effectiveness of the phytohormones when applied to already mature plants. I expect reduced time to maturity, increased yield, and an above normal salutary effect. Hopefully, it doesn't taste like shit. I just need permission to run the plan through the fabricator. So, this led to an interesting place. of stuff, huh? Oh, another transcribe. <laughs> Did I, I thought your shift isn't for another two hours, but I need you to come in now. Is everything okay? No, it's not. Stop by my cabin first. Bring the gun from my safe. Transmitting the key code. Right away, Captain. Aye, aye, Captain. Uh, she didn't say it was a golden gun. <laughs> Alright, so... It would appear that this has allowed me to bypass the, um... The very difficult to do thing, so I'm up here now. Is this gonna be like the end of the game? <laughs> Is he in here? Have I found him? My brother, my dear brother. My secret blind. I've been James Bond all along. You never suspected, which makes sense. You used to sneak into my room when we were kids. I get my computer. I still remember when you ruined my galactic and keys to those save files. I broke your arm when I found out. I regret that now, but I'm still not fond of you messing with my stuff. Smoke signals. Oh, I've already read that. Is that a puzzle? Not necessarily, no. Oh, no, no, no. I meant, I meant I want to use it. No password requires hacking. 
looking for. This one I didn't read yet. I asked Brandy if she, if she felt betrayed by her paraplexes. She nodded, not in agreement, but understanding my point. Because they discovered they could map my brain, but I can't accept a neuromod myself? Her smile became firmer. I think that makes the gift more meaningful. It would be a year before it was quietly decided by Transtar to receive no further neural maps, connectomes, from paraplexus patients, citing unspecified risks. Even he had one of the baseball gloves. Nothing, nothing else in here. Oh, if I could, if I could leverage this, I could get through there. So I can go further up, right? What is further up? Mimics? Telescope? Look into the sun? Is there a secret on the moon? It'd be funny if there was. I have left a secret on the moon, but you must look at it at exactly the right day and time and year. Alright, so what what is up here? What's... Maybe nothing? Right, so this place is not as special as I thought that it might be. Unless... Point. Where am I going? There was no point. Haha, -ha, if I look in the other end of the telescope, I'll be able to see germs. Right? Is that how is that how science works? <laughs> Medical operators flying his way up here. All right, I, I guess there's nothing else interesting in the Arboretum. Other than whatever's over there. To the east. I mean, to the... to my left. Also, can I see a tree from here that looks like it might have initials in it? Is the tree on the moon? Do they have trees on the moon? Ah! Ow! I should have hovered a little bit more than that. Oh, I've been over here. I've been over here, but missed the greenhouse checklist that tells me what the greenhouse password is. But I no longer need it. Yes, now we're gonna go. Whoops. Let me eat these while I'm thinking about it. Eat. Nom. Nom. <laughs> what? The. Yes, Futurama's whales on the moon.
whalers. Whalers. Golden gun. Welcome. Maybe I can help you. Diagnosing. Looks like you had a rough day. Good as new. You can fill out a service credit. Nice if there was a button to like select all food. I'm not I'm not gonna carry around a bunch of food. Oh, well, that's very bad. And have I scanned the nightmare? If I, if I want to scan him, I must continue to retreat while doing so. And then complete it from a safe distance and then continue to flee. Alright, so... Retrace my steps. Are you here for an appointment? Diagnosing. Looks like you had a rough day. This won't take long. There. All better. <laughs> Gluing him is not the solution. Thought I would be clever. By clever, I mean fire a glue gun at him. Diagnosing, bruising, abrasions, fatigue. Nothing like this. This won't take long. Oh. So it's specifically after you go in this room and then come out. He's like, okay, now, now my hunt shall be in. Maybe we'll even throw a quick save right here. This time he didn't see me. Yes, he did. Is that a person? Nope. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm zoomed in. Can he come in here? Yes. 
successfully and then leave him alone I guess the solution is to not get spotted in the first place this is also a form of solution oh the timer's not running yet rude You bet I can run between his legs. Crouch, crouch, go. I was crouching. Okay, now he's lost sight of me, so... From a distance... Nope. He ruined my suit after killing me. How did he get there so fast? Right, well, at least now I can come in here and hide, I, I guess, if I want to do it that way. I can wait here and, and see when he... no? Is he stuck now? Could be. I, I guess that means I could also try killing him now, <laughs> but... Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing of 
portable medical kit to handle. All done. You can fill out a service credit. So yeah, I, I could try killing him, but that would that would be extra cheap. <laughs> like, there's ways that I could have, you know, as soon as I aggroed him, I could have run into the room there and just waited the three minutes. It would have been basically the same as this. I also forgot that I have my decoy power now. No, do I? Or did I change my mind? Or do I have my stun power? Bullets. My enemies, enemies, enemy. I would read those, but they're not as amusing as Time Knife. They broke the mold when they made Time Knife. Plated trophy pistol once belonging to the four-time world champion sport shooter Seleth Rain. The champion visited Talos I to capture a connectome of his brain in the Neuromod's vision. During his visit, he was moved to pre prevent present the pistol as a gift to Captain Jada Marks. Is it better than a pistol? Base 16 and goes up to 17. And is 15, or yeah, 15, 15, and 60. So it's possible that it's very slightly better than a normal gun if I hadn't already. <laughs> right? Because this. Oh no, wait, hold on. This right now is at 16. Okay, and so is, okay, this one, is, all right. So it is, unfortunately, it is better, but I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna use it. Because I've already dumped five upgrades into a regular pistol. Also, not silenced? Interesting. Yeah, it's a shame. Do I have... Can I...
thought maybe it would teleport me through to the other side. It does not. <coughs> Alright, I should probably wrap it up. Let's, uh... Move forward to a convenient point that is, uh... Close to whatever objective I was going to go for next. Elias Black, did I find him? Have I been in Danielle Show's room? This was blasted open. Was she the one that had a... No. So was she supposed to have a map? One of the two of them had something written underneath her desk. So it must be the other one then? And I don't have her key card. I stand on here I am not projected onto the thing oh well anniversary reminder May 23rd May 23rd May 23rd is that gonna be the combination to a safe Oh, it even says so. Calvino, <laughs> Calvino, safe. <laughs> oh, and there is the safe. Cool. Visor prototype. Never. I have never removed a neuromod, and yet today I could not find my way to the hardware labs. I wandered the arboretum for an, an hour. I wonder what that's like, I wandering the arboretum for an hour. I know, me you suspects. I cannot keep making toys for Transtar when... I told Alex what I want to try. He gave me a device to help. Parapsychological contraption. Morgan made it. Some of the components are beyond me. This dream... Again, oh, no, there wait is a second. something wrong with this station. Something here with us, but I am hallucinating now. There, uh, there, there is no question. He was the guy that had the coffee mug hidden compartment. Did that require a key code? I, I tried to open the locker, but I, I could not remember our anniversary. 
And for a moment, even her name escaped me. Her name. If one day I wake up and cannot even remember the work I am doing, I must give it all to Morgan. He will know what to do with it. Okay, give it to me then. First test. Anterior electrodes overheated uh, after six seconds. Those are rookie but numbers. I swear, there was a moment I saw her again. The day we met on the Costa Amalfi. Her lemon sundress. My Clorinda. Nothing inside, just a bunch of practically nothing. Three neuro mods, I take it back, that's not practically nothing. Infinite gloves, infinite bananas. All right, let's end the stream. It's been a long stream. <laughs> so thank you everybody for watching, and I hope you're enjoying. I'm. I don't know. It, it, this feels more like a not stream game, like something where you <laughs> you do just want to kind of spend a while doing what I'm doing here where I just like wander around like I'm I'm gradually getting stronger by I guess finding all these little hidden caches of things but um you know we'll keep playing it and maybe I'll try to focus a little bit more on the main story and get through it and then at the end like like all games of this nature it's gonna go okay even if you beat the game you can still go back and and faff about regardless of how the story is supposed to end we need to give you the opportunity to go complete your checklist of everything there, there is to do. <laughs> so I could beat the game and then if I want to play it more offline. So maybe, I don't know, we'll figure something out. Not that I have anything really lined up to play after this, but we'll see. Uh, so thank you for, for watching and see you next time. I'm streaming this on Thursday. Today's Thursday. I'm streaming this on Saturday. <laughs>